Hello there, welcome into this new video. Let's take a look at which artificial intelligence application for generating images is the best tools for us. So what it would be the stability of the stable diffusion application, whether it would be Medjourney or Jelly number two. In today's video, I'm just going to be focusing into these three applications because I focused into three or even four different tools that the three applications have i'm pretty sure that there are lots and lots and lots of other applications that can be helping you to create more tools more great images but in today's video you're going to be focusing into three of them and what i want to tell you guys is that it's really really easy to have a jelly account and i was trying to do exactly the same thing with the other application i was trying to make a quick comparison between these three applications speaking about the sign up section and the introduction to the website so what i did here is to create an account and automatically i was sent it into this place so i can see that there are like a few ways to create different ideas and all that but i was trying to do exactly the same thing into the stable diffusion and once I went to the stable diffusion, I assumed that the application was inside the API. So I went into the API and in here I was trying to look for the application and I found something like the stable diffusion on additional BAF. So I do have the open in Calaf. Link below to try it yourself. And here I'd opened the stable diffusion with additional BAE's demo. So what I was trying to do here is to create an account into Hugging Face and open the actual application. But I found that there's a lot, a lot, a lot of things. If you don't know anything about coding, this might be really difficult for you. So at the end of the day, I ended up uh, going into the Dream Studio and inside Dream Studio, I was sent it in here and I was successfully now in here. And now speaking about the mood journey, I was seeing something like this. So what I wanted to do is to go into the joint video mode. I find that there was a discord and I hit into accept invite the invitation. And then what happened here is that I needed to have another, uh, another social media or another application already signed it in, in order to enter into mid journey. All right. So now, as you can see, I'm now into mid journey. So I'm going to hit into this miss got it and here to have the mid journey option i have the browse channel the announcement the titles the rules and the support and all of that so as you can see it was a little difficult to enter the application if i want to talk about which one was more fitable for me of course they will be dali number two and now talking about like which one can do the work better the best i think that um, it's really easy to use Dali number two. Here into Dali number two, I'm going to go into my history and I'm going to show you something that I created a few seconds ago. I created something like this. So uh, I'm going to hit into edit form. And as you can see, I, I want to just scroll a bit down to try to look for what I just asked to the computer to create for me like for example let's get into here so i asked the application to create an astronaut an astronaut writing a killer world through a galaxy concept art mod painting 8q and 4k to the computer create something like this for me and of course i ended up editing like the helmet like the backpack uh, i added more whales there i edited this this backside of the whale and here in dream studio I was trying to do exactly the same thing. You don't have to be worrying about here because I just import the same images. So what I wanted to do is to go into the history so I can be showing you something like this. So the computer into Dream Studio created me this image. I want to actually delete this, but I don't know how to go back here. So here was something that was generated for the computer something like this so i think like speaking about the resolution speaking about the high quality the 4k dream studio did a really really great job but speaking about like the concept art 
Dali do something much more interesting and I think Dali like it did did work. Now and here in the mid journey I went here into the Discord and that was actually uh, a little bit let's say like lost because I didn't know how to find the the section where I can just start to edit my own my new stuff. So what I did is to go into the newbie section and here into the newbies I wanted to look for let's say exactly the same thing. I went into the history section, I went into the image that I created and I copy and pasted the description so I can paste that into this code. So what I did here is to add the the imagine here into the prompt and went into of course I just need to delete this apostrophes like this, like this and like this and hit into enter and see what the application was able to do for me. Let's try with anime girl sitting on the car new in the midnight and high quality. I'm gonna copy and generate this into Dream Studio and into Dali number two as well. So I'm gonna go into my account. I'm gonna go back here. And what I want to do is to close this panel and try to do something like this. So let's see what both applications did for me. So as you can see, I do have four different options. I do have this one, I do have the other one. I think like for my taste, uh, this one looks really, really great. Like I can't see a lot of options here, but I can just focus into this one. And here I want to go into variations. So doing like more and more and more variations between different generated images is going to be helping me a lot. Now in here, it says you have not been charged for images blurred by the safety filter. So I want to go into safe. I want to do something like this and like this and go into the scale here into steps. I'm going to hit like this and number of images I'm gonna hit into six and see if the computer can do actually do something because I I think I'm gonna just uh, stick around with Dali number two because Dali number two is really accessible Dream Studio I can still not understand how does this work and Met Joni it works actually it did works but it it's a little complicated to use the Discord if you don't know how to use the Discord you might be needing to go into the quick start section of Met Joni so they can be helping you to understand how to use this but if you want to like create something like really easy to have it accessible I think that you might be needing to use of course Dali number two which in my case I think both the three of them those are like the best options that we do have here so let's take a look into these images i think it's looking really really awesome right i think i kind of like that i kind of like the fact that we do have a lot a lot a lot of variations i can just go into edit the generation frame and here i want to just copy and paste the same thing here the anime girl sitting on a cartoon um 4k resolution hq to generate and we're actually good to go but uh, what you can do here is to use the three applications figure it out by yourself if it's worthy or not if you want to take your time to see how does each application works and try to do like the same image using the three applications you can do that in my case i just want to stick around with dali number two because dali number two is really doing a really great work and so far for me, I think like I'm just going to stick around with this for a while. So hopefully guys, this was a very useful video for you. Now don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if this was very useful for you. Thank you so much for watching the video guys. Good luck with this one. Have lots of fun and I will see you in the next video.